whenever you're working with data inside of Excel, you may want to insert rows and columns. So for that, let's say I want to insert something like a discount over here. So I can simply go here and then you can see that I can either insert cells. You can insert cells, you can insert seat columns and so forth. So I'm going to say insert cells and there you go. There's a new column right there as you can see right here. And it comes on the left side. But uh, what I want to do is uh, it's actually tedious to go over here and then insert it. An easier way to do it is to go over here and right click it and press insert. So a column is inserted right there as you can see. So I can add in something like a discount over here. I'm going to uh, select the design and then uh, remove the filter over here. So just gonna go over here, filter button and remove. All right, so discount maybe 2%, just like this and 3% and so forth. So I can add in the formulas to actually uh, adjust the calculation just like that. So I can actually change this out just like that. Uh, even for the, uh, even for the uh, rows, I can actually right click and insert just like this. But usually when you have other data over here, let's say here I have another data and if I were to insert uh, um, a row over here, the data actually moves below. So if you have other data, then you may not want to do that. So in that case, I'm going to select the cell right here So I'm, because I'm just going to insert my data over here. So I selected this, I'm going to right click and then going to press insert. So I have uh, an option whether to insert uh, the table rows above um, and to the left or right. So I'm going to say table rows above and now you can see that only uh, this table is affected. This area is affected and the data here is not affected at all. Similarly, if you want to delete um, the rows and columns, simply select it out, right click and delete it out. So table rows or columns, you can simply see that you can delete this out right here. So I'm going to say um, uh, delete table rows and so forth. You can even select uh, this discount area over here, right click and delete it out and you can see that I deleted the columns. So that is how you can um, add and remove columns inside of Microsoft Excel. Hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.